Why not choose a pit bull terrier? In recent years, we have visited a lot of dog breeders who are mainly engaged in large dog breeds. It was during our conversations with them that we noticed the interesting fact that many of them mentioned that, although they are now breeding a certain breed, but the best dog of their lives is considered to be a pit bull terrier that previously lived with them. When asked why, if this is the case, pit bulls are not bred, we usually got the answer that keeping a pit bull terrier was too much trouble even for them and that the vast majority of those interested in dogs do not even recommend this breed in everyday life. Although the creators of this channel also despise the capabilities of pit bull terriers, however, they fully agree with what has been said, this breed can really only be recommended to a narrow stratum of future dog owners with a good heart. Why? We will try to summarize it for you in the following five points. Before we go any further, we would like to ask you, if you have not already done so, subscribe to our channel. For you it's a second and a click, but for us, it means a lot. Dual character from the past. To understand the character of pit bull terriers, it is inevitable to talk in short about the formation and past of this breed. The pit bull terrier is one of the few dog breeds, similar to the Tosa Inu or Bully Kutas, who were created for the successful fight against dogs. Their temperament is therefore characterized by a duality that is so difficult or impossible to understand and process for those who are not really familiar with this breed. On the one hand, pit bull terriers are extremely hardy and fearfully effective fighters and, in addition, they enjoy fighting, as unfortunately we have personally seen it on several breed shows, in the case of dogs that fall on each other by accident, due to the fault of their handlers. A very large proportion of pit bull terriers perceive fighting with other dogs as work, which is due to their past and genetics. On the other hand, to address the second half of this duality, there are few dog breeds that are so kind and accepting of their human environment, their owner, and their family, and this is not a myth. There is an extremely simple reason for this, which also stems from the history of the breed, in the past, in the rings and pits, where dogfights took place, no dog could show even the slightest sign of aggression towards people. If such a thing happened, the specimen was immediately taken out from the selection, which at that time meant the final removal from the breeding lines or destruction. Humans have always been the most selfish animals. Before you misunderstand something, we also want to make it clear that the creators of this channel do not approve of dog-to-dog -dog fights in any way. Regardless of the fact that we do not accept all this, we still need to talk about this if we talk about pit bull terriers objectively. No dog vacations and dog parks. The pit bull terrier, along with the Tosa Inu, is the breed of dog that is forbidden by law in most countries of the Western civilization to breed and even to keep in many places, like in Europe for example. This is partly due to the lack of information from lawmakers and the negative publicity in the press, but also to the potential danger that a pit bull terrier in uninitiated and unprepared hands could pose to the animals around them, primarily other dogs. If one chooses this breed, he should be aware that in the foreseeable future, an owner traveling with such a dog will never be welcomed in the western half of the world, and in fact they will not even be allowed into many countries. In the same way, they will not be welcomed in public dog parks and dog communities, as everyone has some, mostly negative beliefs with these dogs, partly because of the negative press coverage, partly because of the legends, and partly because of the real character of the pit bulls, or, the irresponsibility of the owners of some individuals. Non-pack animals. As we have heard from a pit bull breeder who has been breeding pit bulls for several decades and who, by the way, is also perhaps the most successful breed rescuer, the pit bull terrier is not a pack dog. Of course, as always, there are exceptions, but even those who are particularly familiar with the breed and really knowledgeable about them cannot keep them without separation, since they are very dominant and dangerous fighters. As this breeder put it, even dogs that have known each other since puppyhood and grew up together can fight in an instant even on a blade of grass, so that by the time you get home, a fatal injury can be the result of the conflict. Physical Abilities, Need for Activity Anyone who understands even a little about dogs should admit that pit bull terriers are dogs with a fantastic build and physique, which is why they are so effective in fights and many other activities. They are terrifyingly tenacious and explosive, but at the same time extremely strong for their body size. 
This is partly because few dog breeds have had a history of such a hard and bloody selection process in which only the individual who remained standing in the ring could pass on their genes. Maintaining this above the average, outstanding physique requires a lot of time and energy, a well-maintained pit bull terrier will rest for half an hour after an hour of hard work and would start the daily program again even several times a day. However, from what has been said before, this is by no means an easy task for a responsible owner, since there is no freedom, in most cases the dog cannot be released from the leash, especially not in an urbanized environment. So, the owner has to reinvent himself and independently, play sports, go to weight pulling sessions with the dog, or buy a treadmill, or create the time to ride many miles a day with a dog on a leash. Let us have no illusions, very few people in our time are able to do this, but without these activities it is almost impossible to achieve and maintain a proper mental and physical level for a pit bull terrier. Summary Although pit bull terriers will never be our favorite breed of dog, but whenever we have seen them, we sincerely respected the almost unprecedented condition and genetic heritage that can be found in them. Regardless, we live in an age where this breed can only be recommended for those who does not only want a status symbol next to them and who have the expertise, time and experience to properly control a dog of such strength, efficiency and energy level. If you don't have all of the aforementioned time, experience and expertise, then don't choose this breed. Believe us, it will be better for yourself and for your environment as well.